good morning, everybody. Beautiful day here, a little overcast. We're actually on Middle Cove Beach, and we're gonna be doing a short five kilometer hike along a path called uh, Silver Mine Head Path, which is up by Middle Cove Beach, which is where we are right now. Um, just an opportunity to sort of clear my head and uh, get a chance to soak in a few more days of nice weather here. We've had a great summer and a phenomenal fall. So we're going to do the hike and uh, see what we see. Bit of a little bit of a rock face here, nothing serious. Okay, so here we are, Silver Mine Head Path. I think it's about just under 5K altogether. Let's do it. Beautiful views of Middle Cove. I've had a bit of a weight loss yo-yo ride over the last number of months. Back in March, I decided I needed to get healthy, physically, so I went ahead and changed my diet, eased off on the drinking, and got really involved in hiking, which I love. Ended up dropping about 35 pounds, feeling really good, and uh, kind of went into a deep, dark funk. Some people lose their appetite when they're depressed. It's kind of the opposite for me. I uh, started eating a lot of junk, not taking care of myself, and the hikes basically stopped. So I ended up uh, putting pretty much all the weight back on. Felt really crappy. And about a week ago, I decided I gotta pull myself out of this somehow. So with, with help from a lot of different people, friends, family, professionals, I'm at the point now where I've got the energy to give it a go again. I will say, when you stop exercising, your endurance drops just as fast as your weight increases so but I do know that mental health and physical health are very much connected and so doing things like this really helps getting out in the sun getting lots of vitamin D and uh, clean oxygen in the air very beneficial My favorite parts of coming out here is these wide open views. I don't think there's a trail system in North America as breathtakingly and harshly beautiful as the East Coast Trail. I'll get a little closer to the ocean and get some nice uh, salt fresh air in my lungs. I should purge out all the crap. Looks a lot more dangerous than it is. Maybe.
soul. Never gets old. It's like we're coming up to a bridge here. Most of these trails I think were used by people way back in the day before the roads went through and they were used kind of as paths to get from one community to the next. Transportation wasn't quite as convenient back, back in the uh, early 20th century. Let's keep going. Just about finished here. I was just thinking how these hikes sort of, this is very corny, but seem like a great analogy for life. You're walking along, everything seems to be level, pretty good, and all of a sudden you trip up. Sometimes you fall down. You wonder if you're going to get up again, but you do. You get up and you manage to find a level area where you get a great view like that you see something special you experience something special and life's good again i guess the trick that i have to keep reminding myself is that when you trip it's not the end of the game brush yourself off get up and keep moving forward Hope you guys enjoyed the video.